In this video, we show how we create the patina of a reproduction frame. Specifically, it is an 18th century Salvatorosa frame without carvings. Patina consists of the aging procedure of the golden surface. This technique is fundamental to give the reproduction a sense of authenticity. A well-made patina is characterized by showing scratches and micro breaks along the sides of the frame. It is also characterized for giving the gold a dark shade, enough to recall the gilding of ancient works of art. Starting from the steel wool, we proceed to consume the gold leaf. Subsequently, thanks to the use of a stone, the surface of the gilding is scratched and slightly damaged. Then, we use a rubber hammer to curve the wooden profile delicately. All that is made to recreate an imperfection of time. Finally, the hole serves to produce the effect of false woodworm holes. The last step to finish the pattern is shellac. It is a natural resin manufactured in flakes soluble in 99.9 alcohol, which must be laid on the gilded surface. Mixed with inorganic pigments, a dark solution is created, which has the dual purpose of darkening and protecting the Dutch metal leaf surface from oxidation. Finally, see the difference between the frame at the beginning of the video and the same frame after the patina procedure. Also note the random brush strokes given on the ornaments corners, edges and upper parts to create highlights and contrasts typical of ancient models. <laughs> 